Hello guys, my name is Prakash. Today we are going to see how to upload multiple attachments for an employee for a document type in Oracle Fusion. What is document type? An employee can maintain his documents such as passport, driving license, insurance, etc. We call those as document type. When we migrate the data from any other application to Oracle Fusions, we should also migrate the attachments. Using the HDL data loader process available in HCM, which is Human Capital Management, we are going to add the attachments in the employee document of records. You can also refer my blog as the same information is provided. Let's see the steps that are available for uploading the attachments. In order to upload the attachments, we need to have three files. One is the zip file. One is a BLA folder and another is a DAC file. You can create a folder on your machine and that folder should contain a BLA folder and a DAC file. First, let's create a BLA folder. You can place all your attachments in the BLA folders and make sure the name that you specify should be BLA file. If you are going to provide any other name, the program may complete with error. Now, let's prepare for the DAT file. We are going to use an employee 5791 for loading attachment for document, document type. Now, in this, you can see there are two batch informations. One is the header and another is the line information. Now there is a file that we are going we have to specify a file information and make sure this file should be the same as what you are going to provide in the BLOP folder. And there is a URL.txt or a file name. This is a file name that can be changed as per the name requested by business. In my example, I am going to show you a different name. Make sure that title is unique for each record and now we are good to go with document of records and if you want to have the sample data of the dat file you can refer my blog and now let's do the preparation of the zip file now just need to compress the bill of files in the document of records dot dat file to a zip file the zip file name can be any name that you can provide as per your wish. But always make sure the BLOF folder name should be the same and the documents of records dot dat file should be the same. Now before uploading, let's make sure we do have an attachment for this employee or not. So this is the navigations that should be used to query for an employee. The navigations are my client group and go to the person management, query for an employee and on the side menu you can see a document records. Click on that document records. Now you can see there are no documents attached. Now let's try to upload those attachments. For uploading those attachments, we need to go to HDL process. For navigation, for going to a HDL data process, will be my client group data exchange. Once you reach there, you can see import and load data. Once you click on the import data, you can see an icon on the top import file click on this import file attach the zip file which we have compressed it and once it has successfully loaded the status will be changed to green and once it has successfully loaded you need to verify the data now you can see the attachments have been successfully loaded. Now we have loaded an attachment for an employee 5791. 
who is having the document type as return to work he is having a multiple attachments as you can see on the screen so the text to file pdf file and document file so we have attached multiple attachment for a single document of record type thank you for watching see you next video